Hey guys, previously I made a video of 10 custom light effects on a backlit keyboard, and this video is gonna be the series 2 with 5 effects specifically showing 5 unusual and dumb ways to type with a backlit keyboard. Number 1 Mouse to key input. Basically, it lets you use your mouse to click on keys of a real keyboard, just like using a virtual on screen keyboard in physical space. As we all know, we should have directly press on the keys without a mouse. So, number two, arrow selection input. You can press on arrow keys to move the key selection highlight to the one you want to press and hit the enter button. I guess maybe you're too lazy to move your fingers across the entire keyboard. Number 3. Dynamic Active Area Input only the colored keys are active and responsive to a key press. It means when a key is not lighted up, in this case, the bouncing balls aren't passing through it. You can't type a character with it. Well, I don't know what's good about this. Maybe you want to slow down your typing speed or you want to burn some time for whatever reason. Number 4. Handwriting Input Imagine the keyboard as a touchpad. Well, it really is, but just in a low resolution, like super low resolution. I'd call it restless display. And now, you can actually do a drag with your fingers across a new and somewhat expensive mechanical keyboard that you just bought with initially an expectation to use it for a longer while that you have wanted to protect it as much as possible, at least for a few months just because the handwriting works. digital ball rolling across the keyboard. Wherever it goes, keys under it are pressed. So this is not for regular intentional typing. It's a random typing machine which some hardworking monkeys, the potential Shakespeare reproducers, may love. If you don't know yet, a theorem called infinite monkey says a monkey, or I would say an unlimited amount of monkeys, hitting keys at random on a typewriter keyboard for an infinite amount of time will almost surely type a given text, such as the complete works of Raylan Shakespeare. So this can have a big improvement on productivity and fun for those monkeys, except that you cannot type on keys that are far from each other, which most words are made up with. But look at this, you can disable some keys and they become obstacles. So then you can skip those keys. Alright, forget about those monkeys, let's have some fun. the keyboard can know its rotation with a shadow 3-axis accelerometer. That's all. 
A badly keyboard is nothing new or surprising compared with all other tech devices. But I've got ideas. I like to bring some of these ideas to life and move on to the next. So stay tuned. There will be something more fun and hopefully inspirational. Thank you for watching. Bye.